Dragon. Uh, it's June 21st. Uh, today was a chill day. Um, yeah, so... Sorry, there's some random thing that popped up on the, the capturing thing. Um, anyway, so... Yeah, today I kind of want to talk about following your dreams and following your heart. So, uh, you know, I've been told multiple times uh, that Columbia is not a good, uh, not a good idea by multiple people. Um, you know, it's my parents are worried about my mental health wise. Uh, my brother is. Um, I, I had a meeting with a vocational rehab today. Uh, you know, he wants me to go in a certain direction, um, pretty much go get a job. Um, the thing is that I'm not, I'm not doing, uh, brain. Okay. Yeah. It's been, it was kind of a weird day. So my, my brain's kind of out and then also I'm pretty chillaxed today. So, um, apologize for like a little spacey and things. But, um, really, it's, all, it's, it's about following your, your dream and following your heart, um, and not letting people uh, talk you out of it, even though it's, you know, their best intention, you know, their best intentions, um, you know, just, just getting the support, you know, uh, that support from yourself versus other people, um, I'm going and, and doing, trying to do this dream because I, it's what I feel like I want to do. Uh, and that's it. That's all it is. I'm not really doing it for anybody else. Um, I've spent a lot of my time doing stuff that other people think I should be doing. Um, partly why I was in school, um, and I realized partly I was in school was because my, I wanted, you know, I wanted to make sure my parents were proud. You know, both of my parents have degrees, uh, and they push school pretty heavily. So, my thing is that I'm just, no, I'm just tired of it. So, I want to do me, I'm, then that's the entire plan. Uh, is it going to work out? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Uh, but I'd rather have a plan of mine not work out than a plan that... I'm doing it for somebody else and then not work out, right? Um, you know, with school, it's super hard because I was just I was just pushing, 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 um, and you know I realized, like I said earlier, that I wasn't really in it all the way for me. You know, um, my heart of hearts, I should have left school uh, a couple years ago. You know, but I was I was kind of being pushed for it, and then also. Um, for my own thing is I was thinking that, um, I have to, uh, I, how do I say it? It's, it's kind of a weird thing, but like, you know, I joined the military to get a degree pretty much like I joined so I can, you know, get the GI bill and then get the benefits of it and then get a degree. But, uh, you know, it, it wasn't all me. Now I'm doing it for all me. And I think it's going to work out. You know, I think it's going to work out. And it's all about the pressure that I put on myself. Uh, today I kind of feel a little, uh, uh, not lost. Um, that's not the right word for it. Just, I'm kind of decompressing today. I spent a lot, I mean, I'm playing Stellaris again still. Um, determined exterminators, robots, you know, taking over the galaxy. Um, I'm playing it and I just, I just kind of vegged out today. You know, I had a meeting earlier, a couple meetings. Um, one was with the Voc Rehab people, one was Slug Support, um, since, uh, because I'm getting teeth, my teeth done. There's Slug Support and it's going to cost me pretty much like $800 uh, next week which I'm not looking forward to. Um, it's kind of wiping me out completely. So I'm, I'm a little bit, uh, it's been, it's been crazy. It's just the, the, the amount of money. So, uh, I went to slug support to maybe get some help, 
but they told me since I just graduated, now Slug Support is the kind of emergency fund for students at the school. Um, but since I just graduated, then I am no longer a student. So therefore, I uh, can't get that benefit anymore, which is uh, frustrating to say the least. You know, I mean, spent a whole bunch of money here and uh, a whole bunch of time. You know, I'm an alumni now, uh, which is crazy, actually. Wow, I didn't. Wow. I, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, alumni now, but um, it just, yeah, they're just like, yo, sorry, we can't help you. It's not the lady's fault. It's just the grants. The grant is uh, for retention, uh, she was explaining to me. Um, and since I don't need to be retained anymore in the school, then I get kind of. Um, left out in the dust, but that's okay. I mean, it's, it's all about making it happen. Uh, I'm not really thinking too much about it. Like I, I can't, I'm not going to go, um, I'm choosing like in, in the past, I would have been more pissed off. Just like, just going down the road and just like, bam, like this place sucks and blah, blah, blah. But, um, one of the things is I'm choosing not to be the victim anymore. You know, I'm choosing to say, okay, uh, that's not in the card, so now I am just going to go get or go find some way to you know, make that money and make the money. So um, I have some other income coming in. Um, you know, I have to get the stuff done, so I'm probably going to do it. I was thinking about waiting till Columbia. It might be cheaper. It's probably going to be cheaper. Uh, but um, I'd rather get it handled now so then if something were to happen or whatever... Uh, so I don't have to worry about it anymore. You know, uh, you know, what's the price of, of, uh, a, a, a clean mind, you know, and a, and a, or not a clean mind, but a, a mind, you know, to not have to worry. Um, and that is, you know, it's, it's infinite, you know, that price is infinite. Um, so I would, you know, if I, if I can, spend some money now so I can get my teeth fixed uh, and make sure that it doesn't get worse so then I actually have natural teeth instead of going and having to get implants or whatever um, I'm just going to do it I just have to so that's one thing um, like I said earlier the uh, the big thing is just follow yourself or follow you set a goal and you know do the things to get to that goal and don't let people stop you even though if they're your family or your friends um you know it's like why why are you doing this well i mean i just feel like it i, I feel i feel like it's the best move for me um it means i can contract my expenses pretty hardcore um it's, it means that i'm not in my parents house because that's kind of the only alternative and i'm trying to you know, my, my, uh, my family is great, but they, they're very nesting, right? So what that means is that, uh, they never want me to really leave the nest in a way. They're always willing to pick up financial stuff. Um, you know, currently right now my grandma replaced my car, um, you know, which is, it's great. It was great. Like it's great now. It's, it's, it's an awesome thing. Um, it's for school. So I don't have to worry about getting around, um, and also, uh, you know, pay for my cell phone bill. Uh, that's a huge thing. Um, you know, so I want to change, right? I want to, I need to leave the nest. I mean, I'm 33, you know, it's kind of late for it, but, um, you know, I mean, and, and their best intentions are to help out. They know how crazy and hard it is out here to kind of make it. Right, especially in this economy, uh, but having that pressure and having you know me me having the you know having to deal with the consequences of my actions are huge. <coughs> so um, that's the thing. Like I I'm planning on taking all that stuff, everything that I use, and everything that I um, that I need. I'm gonna provide for myself. So um, it's not happening right now. Um, just cause I'm in transition and things like that. But before I go to Columbia, I want to have it so I can, I know. And I also, I can be more uh, grateful for it too. 
you know, because it's, it's one of the things in which, since it's just there, like, I don't really think about it. It's like my phone, like, it's just there. Like, it's like, cool. But I never have to worry about paying the bill or whatever. And uh, it kind of increases my my um, gratefulness with it. So, yeah, just leaving the nest, pretty much. Leaving the financial nest of of uh, dealing with it. Um, it's cheaper to be on a family plan because that's how things are set up and such like that. But my, my thing is I just have to kind of get out of it. So, um, yeah, yeah. So just follow your dreams, follow your heart, you know, and, um, you know, make it happen, make it happen. So that's, that's it. Uh, today kind of tired. Um, I don't know. It's just a weird day to, today. Like just kind of coming out of, um, my fog of like kind of vegging out all day. Like I'm, I'm kind of not on my, my game. So I kind of needed it. Um, I needed it a little bit so I can, uh, you know, I, I just have, I, you know, I, I still have to kind of heal, you know, and also just realize that I'm not in school anymore. And that's, that's kind of what's going on. So, yep. Well, I'm going to let y'all go. Uh, and, yeah, be be good to yourself. So have a good day.